the daughter of Reverend Ivan Ozarkovic, a priest who was later elected to the Austrian parliament, and Tofila Okunovska, she was born Natalia Ozarkovic in the village of Bileluya in the Halichina province of Galicia. At that time, women were not allowed to pursue education beyond the elementary level and so she was mainly educated at home. She studied several languages, German, French, Polish, and Russian and read literature from various counties. He died a few years later and she was forced to return to Belekov to live with her parents. Kobrinska went to Vienna with her father, where she met Ivan Franco, Franco encouraged her to take on the task of improving the status of Ukrainian women and to encourage them to seek equality with men. In 1884, she organized the Tverist Vorus Kyks Hynok, Association of Ukrainian Women, to educate women by exposing them to literature and by promoting discussions on women's rights. In 1890, she was part of a delegation that lobbied the Minister of Education to allow women to attend university. She wrote her first short story Shumanska, later known as The Spirit of the Times, in 1883, the following year, she wrote a novella for a piece of bread. In 1887, with Olena Pchilka, she edited Prashai Vinok, The First Garland, a collection of writing by Ukrainian women. Her work was translated to English for the collections The Spirit of the Times, 1998, and Warm the Children, O Son, 1998.